welcome to Top Wine Presents. I'm your host, Susan Wokeli. Today's show is a reflection of my journey through the EMDT program at Fusel University. It was approximately one year ago that I came across that email on that fateful day advising me of the EMDT program at Fusel University. After carefully analyzing and thinking through and researching the program, I decided it was time I took a chance and embarked on a journey into my master's degree program. Let's take a look at my journey and my experience. So, um, it started with my first video in my first class, my MLR class. I had to do a video telling of why I chose the program. Let's listen in and see what I had to say. I chose Full Sail University because uh, it, it had the that's the school that offers the program of interest to me and also this program was very um, got my attention because it's accelerated is only one year and uh, there was a twelve thousand dollar scholarship and um, full sale has been sending me information for for a long time I look at them I go wow interesting but I would toss the paper aside but when I got the email concerning the uh, education media design and technology masters I, I couldn't pass that opportunity up so um, I chose online learning because it is very flexible for me I'm really busy I find it very difficult to set aside a time to go into a traditional classroom to sit with an online school setting I can log online sometimes after everyone everyone else has gone to bed I can log on and have a quiet house and do my homework my coursework and what have you so it makes it very flexible for me I call it learning on the go as, as the video I clearly showed I made the right choice by choosing this program through my master's program I learned about technology and education I incorporated streaming videos and films in teaching my kindergarten students let's hear them in their elements by the letter A. The answer is A. I talked about film and its impact in the classroom, as well as music. I learned that music is essential, especially when used in the right way to teach. I learned that video helps visual and auditory learners. I use these methods to enrich and to take my students to a new height. I learned how to work with ScreenFlow, using it to videotape videos and movies for voiceover in my film class. This was one of the most exciting things, being that I'm a filmmaker myself. It was nice to finally be a commentator. I enjoy knowing that I could use video games, something that students related to, to teach them. I experimented with FarmVille. I was allowed to make a film in Second Life and to visit visual library. This was exciting to me as me and my avatar took a tour of Second Life. Being able to explore using a different form was exhilarating. I embarked on an action research project which was a huge part of my program. Through my action research project I was able to learn ways of using technology to teach my kindergarten students to read and write sight words. My findings through the research is something that I can never, ever, ever give anything to take it back. In the end, I learned that the future is the children and that we must continue to learn. I learned about interview and presentation skills, which is clearly shown in this video. It is interesting what you said about how, you know, when you give up on learning, you're giving up on yourself. And these are the children that you that we're teaching, that you're teaching, these kindergartners are the leaders of tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So um, for those of you out there who are interested in the teaching profession, Ms. Ori just told you what you need to do. You gotta keep it fresh, keep it fun, incorporate technology, and always keep learning and don't give up. I thank you for your time in watching my reflection and my journey through my EMDT program at Fusa University and I encourage you to take the same leap of faith.